Hello guys, how are we doing? It's Luke from the Free Hammers. I noticed a few of the channels have done um, some reaction videos to the Felipe Anderson finally being announced. Um, so I thought I'd chuck the Brazil shirt on. You know, West Ham signing a Brazil player for £40 million is unthinkable. If you would have told me this during the season, after that Burnley game, after all the protest, all the craziness around the team, you would not think that this was going to happen. You really... It's crazy. The scenes, uh, Twitter has exploded. Um, all back to hashtag balding. We believe back in David Sullivan. But listen, the board had to make this statement this year, and 103 million has been sent, or 106 million, something like that, isn't it? Um, amazing. You're like this guy. I've watched some clips. Um, I knew a little bit about him anyway. Um, just I do follow a bit of Serie A, and he's he's a really like busy player. He's got lovely feet. He just sort of floats through. Um, I see a stat that he's the most successful dribbler last season in terms of uh, success when he's picked the ball and dribbled up. So um, that's what we want to see. You know, We want to see some ball carriers, and we've got that now. Yamachenko, um, Wilshere can pick the ball up, carry it, run with it. And we've got, obviously, Felipe Anderson now. And they've all got that unlockable past, which we've been lacking. Now, if we can keep an Arnie, which I think will happen, Arnie scored yesterday as well, didn't he? Keep Hernandez. It's exciting times. Um, listen... Every signing is a gamble. He may not pay off, but for me, I don't know. I think for Pellegrini, for this to be his main man, the one he really, really wanted, he sees something and he knows surely this is he's going to build around him and he's going to be the key man for West Ham. It's really, really exciting. Um, I don't think that's the end, though, guys, either. Um, obviously, I sort of said it in the podcast. I think there's still probably two more areas we should look at, maybe, maybe three, a centre-back because of Reed's injury, a CDM and possibly a striker. Uh, X did put out, obviously, uh, he expects maybe a free and possibly a couple of loans because obviously we've still got the loan market to play with. So maybe that free could be Bernard, perhaps another Brazilian international that we could get in. This uh, talks of apparently reopened, apparently wants a lot of wages though. Uh, for me, we've got to be looking around that Chelsea team as well for some of them loan players that could be available. Barkley, uh, Drink, Danny Drinkwater, Ruben Loftus Cheek, you know, they're not going to get in that team. Uh, Jorginho obviously has just gone there, hasn't he? Um, in terms of strikers, you know, I've always liked Solomon Rondon. Um, I can't really think. Uh, anyone else there, guys, striker wise, that you sort of stand out that would really make our team better? That's actually a realistic target. In terms of defenders, you've got Lascelles, Alfie Mawson, you know, if they really want to push the boat out, maybe with another fee. Um, let me know guys it's really really exciting times uh, also uh, X did also say about that he expects players now that have been told that they can leave the club potentially those deals can start being announced I definitely think Antonio will leave I think Antonio will go to Palace I think um, possibly he did play yesterday but players like your Snodgrasses Sam Byrams um, to name a few, we'll probably be going. One of Obiang, Kiati and Fernandez, I assume will go as well, but we will see. Anyway, guys, until then, I hope you enjoyed the video. Enjoy the World Cup final this afternoon. Um, you know I've got a soft spot for France. I'd love to see them win it, but I've also always liked Croatia. You know, I've always liked the players, Croatian players that have played for West Ham, and it'd be great to see a new winner. But until then, guys, keep believing this positive vibe is coming, and... Really hoping for a good season. Hit that subscribe button. We're about 18 away now from 2,500. Keep believing. Let's go.